I watched Luca a few days ago, and I ended up really loving it. It was... I'm not going to give spoilers, but I don't know how to talk about it without spoilers. Um, but, yeah, it ended up being a really good movie. It I really love the characters and the plot, and, you know, everything was really good. So, I watched Luca, and I really liked it, and I saw things going on where, like, people were drawing themselves as the sea monsters from Luca. So, that's what I'm doing here. And when I first started transferring myself into a sea monster, I was thinking about, like, well, what kind of things... Because, like, the characters look very similar when they're in their human form and their sea monster form. So, I started thinking about my, you know, human form. And I have blonde hair. I have big glasses. Not really big, but rounded glasses. So, I ended up making goggles on the character, which... I was because originally I was gonna give glasses, but then I was like, wait, but the glasses would float away in the water, so I turned it into goggles. But then the straps are like blocked off by the large things. I don't know what they're called, but they look kind of like fins. And there's what what their ears transform into. I don't have large ears, but but I feel like that look of having really large ears just kind of makes it feel more like me. I don't know. My favorite color is blue, so originally that's what I was planning on making it. Then I am on the hair, and I was originally going to make it all the line art black with my normal style of pretty thick line art. But then I just felt like in the all the drawings, like, there's no thick line art in the art style, which, I was, again, I was transferring into my own, but I still gave, like, I tried making the inside of the hair more of a darker version of the color I was going to make it. But then that wasn't working, and it took me a while messing around with it until I liked it. So... Then I moved on to the coloring part after more outlining, which I don't have anything to say about. So then I colored the hair, and because it was like yellow, I was originally going to make the rest of my character blue. But then I thought that purple would go well with yellow, because, you know, opposite whatevers. So I ended up going with more of a bluish purple color. A light indigo. I have light freckles, and most of the characters have freckles in their sea monster form, so... And the scales took a while to make it look okay on the arms, because they also have arm scales. And then for the clothes, I was going to make the... I made the shirt navy, because blue and black are colors I wear a lot. But then I realized I don't really like navy that much. So then I changed it to just blue shirt, black shorts. Nothing fancy with that. And then... The one thing I don't like about my animation program is that the backgrounds, like, if you, for the background here... I tried making gradient, but the only way to do gradient is this weird way where you have to click on the gradient button and then select the colors on which one will be in the middle or the outside or the left or the right or whatever, and then you do that. It's really confusing, and it took a while for me to get the hang of it. And then I was done.